I'm Matthew Aikens and I'm here in Karachi working on a project for Harper's Magazine that's being funded by the Pulitzer Center on Crisis Reporting. With almost 20 million people living in it, Karachi is one of the world's largest megacities. And with almost 3,000 murders last year, it's also one of the most violent. Two facts are related. Every year, hundreds of thousands of migrants from rural areas pour into the city, many of them fleeing from feudal bondage in Sindh or stark poverty and warfare in the mountainous tribal areas. They pack into the city's slums, known as Kachiabadis, where they join the desperate scrabble for survival in space. Nearly 50% of the city's residents live in illegal and unplanned housing. Now, I've been researching the city's criminal gangs, which are linked to the political parties here. These gangs are part of a system where people, because of the failure of the state to provide basic services and the rule of law, turn to them for economic survival, thereby perpetuating a lawless and corrupt system. My work has been focusing in particular on the story of Ozer Baluch, leader of the Amin Committee, a powerful gang, and his attempts to rid himself from his political masters and become his own man, no longer indebted to the cycle of street violence that gave him that authority in the first place. Ultimately, it's a paradox that he fails to transcend. And his tragedy is perhaps Karachi's, both condemned to seemingly unending violence.